Hi everyone, Alvis Ike here. I have a quick video for you today for informational purposes only that I have entitled, Have You Ever Been Hypnotized? I've taken information from Very Well Mind, the psychology space, Therapeutic Trance is a book by Stephen G. Gilligan, and then Self-Hypnosis, a book by Bruce Goldberg. Okay, so let's get to it. So, hypnotic trance can be experienced in a number of ways. Uh, it doesn't have to happen with the use of a pocket watch. If you think of the old movies, you know, where the hypnotist would have a pocket watch on a chain and he'd wave it in front of the, uh, the client's eyes. It doesn't have to happen like that. It doesn't have to happen where the hypnotist is staring in your eyes or anything like that. Okay. Um, in fact, Eric Erickson, a uh, great uh, hypnotherapist, uh, used the cooperation approach to hypnotherapy in terms of in, in inducing uh, hypnotic trance, but that's a whole different video. So, what is the definition of hypnotic trance? Well, from Very Well Mind, um, a trance-like mental state in which people experience increased attention, concentration, and suggestibility. Now, this is a definition that works for me. There are a lot of definitions out there. So, trance can be experienced without purposefully trying, you know, through meditation, through physical exercise, you know, like running, uh, breathing exercises, praying, uh, repetitive type uh, behaviors, if you're into crocheting or anything like that. Uh, I remember often uh, experiencing trance when uh, I was driving, and I you know, still do. Uh, I was fully aware of cars around me, everything was safe and all that, but sometimes, you know, after a while, after I'd driven for a while, uh, you know, I'd look outside and look at the scenery and think, wow, how did I get from point A to point B and not remember any of the scenery in between. Um, it, it was like there's some sort of uh, time warp. Now, from the psychology space, uh, trans state is actually a natural human state that we slip in and out of during the day. Every time you focus down your attention, you enter a kind of hypnotic trance, whereas normal awareness, you know, can involve being aware of many things and the mind hopping around. A defining characteristic of the trance state is a single or limited focus of attention, such as when you're, you're reading, working, or, you know, playing a computer game. During this state, time seems to get distorted. And I'm sure you can come up with other examples, you know, being engulfed in a, in a movie or something like that. Anyway, to answer the question of whether or not you have ever been hypnotized then, the answer is yes. And that's it for now.